Sometimes I wake up and I feel like that I'm dreaming. A nigga made it out the mud, I can't believe it. I know a couple niggas wanna see me bleeding. Shots fired, man down, I ain't breathing. But I told them pussy niggas catch me when they see me. And I got a bad little bitch and she can see me. You too, you too. What's up, man? Your boy Horace is back. So uh, let me just get straight into this video. Um, you want to start off by creating your first guideline. Um, I did like a low taper on my boy Frank. Uh, so this cut came out pretty clean. Uh, just let me know what y'all think in the comments. And uh, I'm going to walk y'all through my process. So my next step is to go underneath that line with my shavers to make it as tight as possible. So for your next step, you want to go ahead and take your two guard and go up about an inch to take off all that bulk. So right here, I'll go ahead and work in a beard. It's basically the same steps as fading. You're just fading down. So my next step is to take my high one and a half guard and I go up about a half an inch. So once that step is done, I'll go ahead and take my lever open and then just go up about an inch. So 
So after I cleaned up that lever open, I go ahead and take my high one and a half guard closed and just soften up that middle line. So my next step is to go ahead and take my one guard open and uh, soften up that middle line even more. I can't believe you did this, man. So once that step's done, I go ahead and take my half guard open and just basically open and close the lever to knock out that middle line completely. Yes, sir. That's some pressure. That's some pressure. So now that that side's done, I'm going to go ahead and work on the other side. Uh, you guys already seen the steps that you have to do. So I'm going to go ahead and speed this part up completely. Uh, so just sit back and enjoy. did this man So now that the fade is tight and clean, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and start his lineup process.
can't believe you did this, man. So for my client's hairline, I'm gonna go ahead and spray some firm dry on it. Um, this just makes it as firm as possible. So when my liners hit it, you know, everything just falling off. I can't believe you did this, man. So right here, I'm gonna go ahead and spray some enhancements on my client. Uh, this is just like a natural color enhancement. You know, it makes it even more crispier. did this man yeah so everything's done um i'm gonna go ahead and just do some clipper over comb to remove some bulk from the top So this is the finished product. Um, I had hit my client with the razor, obviously, but uh, yeah, I go ahead and hit my man with some Jimmy beard oil. Uh, I brush it down after, and this is just, you know, it helps your beard grow, stay moisturized. Um, yeah, man, so the cut's looking pretty clean. Uh, this is a big transformation for my boy, Frank, cause uh, he used to just do taper, so he switched it up to the low fade and, you know, that John came out clean. So uh, shout out my boy Frank, shout out the Crooks Barbershop gang, you know, uh, it's only up from here. I got a couple more videos I'm about to drop for you guys. Um, expect two more videos, two more videos coming, coming next.
uh sorry that this one took too long but it's all good we still on track back on track all right y'all stay tuned for the next video if y'all could just uh leave a like and you know subscribe to my channel that'd be greatly appreciated peace